everyone, welcome back to our channel. Today I'm going to be doing a curly to straight hair tutorial video. So the first thing I'm going to do is wash my hair. I wash my hair with three shampoos. I wash it with the coconut, you see, coconut curl Moroccan oil. And then I do this one, the organ oil, Nivea organ oil shampoo. And then I also wash it with a non-sulfate shampoo, which is the same moisture. Same moisture. I'm gonna go ahead and wash my hair and then get back to you. Okay? Now I am back. And what I did after I put, I mean, what I did after I, I washed my hair, I put in the L'Oreal E bottle. Alivi Extraordinary Clay. I put this product in my hair. When I fry out my hair, I use this product. And then when I curl, when I'm doing a natural hair tutorial, I just place in the Shea, the Shea Moisture's um, Restorative Conditioner. And then the other Moroccan conditioner too. So as you can see, the hair is curly now. It's curly, see? Okay, so this is curly. Now what I do with the conditioner in my hair, I brush it out. I brush my hair out with this brush or brush right here. I brush out my hair with this brush. So brush or brush. And after I brush out my hair, I just rinse out the conditioner and begin blow drying. So I'll get back to you guys when I'm done brushing brushing out my hair. It might take a while. Okay. So after I have fully brushed out my hair, I'm going to rinse out the conditioner and then begin blow dry. Okay. So after I have blow dried my hair, uh, I mean, after I have after I rinse the conditioner out my hair, I blow dry. I want to be blow drying my hair with the Revlon blow dryer. And before I start, I'm going to take my comb and I'm going to, I'm going to, I'm going to, I'm going to split my hair into four sections. So it doesn't have to be perfect. Okay, alright. So what you're gonna do is blow dry your hair, I'm just gonna brush out this section once more. Because it doesn't have the conditioner in it. So I'm gonna brush it out. And I'm going to begin blow drying. I'm going, to get back, I'm going to get back to you guys whenever I blow dry the whole. Okay guys, I have did half of the head. And this blow dry is broke kind of fast. But yeah, I've finished half of the head already. And I'm going to go ahead and order it to you guys when I finish the other half. Okay, as you guys can see, my whole head is blow dry. It's like a really big cotton candy. But yeah, it's blow dry. Ooh. 
okay. So as you guys can see, I have some brown. I don't know if you could tell. But like around my hair, you can see some brown. It's because I had recently dyed my hair black. Yeah, look at it. I recently dyed my hair black and now it's slowly coming out. So that's why you can see some brown and some, some black in my head. Yeah. Yeah, that is how I get my hair for straight to curly. I don't flat it, I just keep it blow dry. And yeah, that's how it turns out to look. So, hope you guys enjoyed this video. This is how I get my hair straight and ready to style it. I just style it like this. And it just goes to the store like that. Just kidding, I don't do that. But okay, after I have t completely blow dried my hair, I take, I actually use two flat irons, but I want to show you, I'm going to go ahead and show you them. So put the blow dryer to the side. I use the, <laughs> I use this one by Remington. This one, big purple one, and then I use the sometimes I use this a little, but not all the time. So yeah, I use that, and then I use one of it. This is the flat, other flat iron I use. It doesn't have a name; it just says GMP, GVP. So I'm gonna use this one too. Two flags. But at first I'm going to use the purple one. The purple one is going to straighten my edges. And I'm going to go over right here with the black and gold one. So what I do when I flatter my hair is I usually just, it's easier to part when it's like this. But I still take my comb and drive it through the middle straight back. Just straight back. Okay, so I part my hair and cut the flat iron on. I usually put it to 400, but I'm just going to use 360 for now. And that's to try and burn all my hair out. So, the first thing I'm going to do is take a small section. Sometimes I get tired and I don't feel like doing small sections. But I part a really tiny section right there in the back. And I take the rest and just put it around here and just let it hang up there while I flatter this part. And whenever you flatter your hair, you might see many YouTubers do this when they straighten your hair on many salons. What you're supposed to do, you're supposed to trace the flat iron with the comb. So like, you have the flat iron on the front. You have to trace it with the comb. I want to get back to you guys whenever I'm at least done half of the head. Okay guys, as you can see, I did half of my head. I did both the back sections first because the back is always the hardest. And this is how it turned out. And then all I have left is the two top sections. And those will be easier to do because I can actually see. So I'm going to get back to you guys so I've done the whole. Okay guys, I am done, but I'm not done. I'm not done. As you can see, it's flat, but it's not flat. I will have to go over it 
one more time to make it flat because I got lazy and I just flat iron in the front in big sections. I'm not going to go over it with the GVP flat iron right now, so to make it more flatter in the front. So the first thing I'm going to do is again split in half, and this is how I record. Okay, so I'm going to put it to the side and like brush it out, of course, and I'm going to start again. Like I'm flying my hair all over again, but this time I don't have to do such small sections. I'm just going to take a back, take this, and put it to the side. video for you guys like how I style my straight hair how I style my curly hair let me know and then I will do those videos for you guys so, so thank you for watching how I go from curly to straight I will be posting a hairstyle video and I will be posting a video of hairstyles for straight hair when you find out your hair so yeah, thank you guys for watching, like and subscribe, leave a comment below, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching. Bye.